Dear Lord, thank you for blessing us with this meal and for watching over us and keeping us healthy. Please bless our new home and guide us in your path in this new city. And forgive us for our sins. Amen. 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 So, Anne, your mother and I were down at the church and spoke to this man, Francis, today. And we mentioned you, and he said that he has a daughter about the same age as you. Her name is Haley, and she's going to your same school after spring break. Okay, cool. Turns out they were assigned a project to do over break. Mm -hmm. And she's going over to her friend's house tonight to work on it. Please tell me you didn't. We asked if you could tag along, and he said, of course. Jesus Christ, Mom, I don't want to be set up on a play date. Do not use the Lord's name in vain. It's not a play date. It's a study session. Hi. Hi. <laughs> you ready for what comes next? I'm guessing you're Haley. You can get in. <laughs> hey, I'm really sorry about my parents. Um, I don't want you to get stuck with me tonight. Oh, I'm not stuck with you. You're totally stuck with me. Um, where are you from? Oh, uh, Wisconsin. Hmm. So we're doing homework tonight. Uh-huh. Yeah, we're doing homework tonight. So, um, how do you like it here so far? Well, I've only been here for three days. So I can't really judge yet. No, no, that's cool. Um, at, at least you moved during spring break, you know? Yeah, and how's your, how was your break? Oh, no, it, it's good. Um, it's, it's nice, like, just kind of hanging out with friends and meeting new people. And... How long have you guys been dating? Oh, um... <laughs> Well, we're not dating. No. No. <laughs> I mean, love is cursed by monogamy. Um, I just, just ignore my friends. They're kind of stupid. Hey, I think what Troy and I are <laughs> trying to say is that you should just do what you love. Well, what do you love? Um, I love the vastness of the world. I love endless possibilities. I love stories. I love art. I... <laughs> I think most of all, I'm in love with strangers. I want to do great things and I'm not going to be here forever. Hey, um, thanks for tonight. I had fun. Um, <laughs> you're kind of an enigma. Excuse me? Do you think you could, um, maybe tell me something honest before you go? Honest? No. Um, I didn't want to move here. I had nightmares for two weeks straight before coming. I bet it really threw a wrench in your plans. <laughs> Just a tad. What about you? You got plans? Um, I don't know about plans, but I love photography. I don't know, it's the best way to know someone without actually knowing them. You're in love with strangers. Maybe I could take your picture. 
sometime. Maybe. <laughs> hey, tomorrow, would you want to do that really boring assignment we have to do? Um, yeah. Yeah, I'd like that. Okay. Oh, um... Yeah. The nightmares. Thanks. Did you do that yourself? Yeah, that's my photography website. It's incredible. Do you want to play a game? Sure. Truth or dare? Can I start? Mm hmm Okay, truth or dare. Truth. What is the craziest thing you've ever done? Oh. That's a really good one. I know. Oh. <laughs> um. When I was 14 for my birthday, my godfather took us, well, he took me to Bangkok. And so we went into the jungle and we found this small village and they basically let us ride these elephants. Oh my God, are you serious? Yeah. The one thing that the tribe told us was not to kick the elephants behind the ears because um, that means run. And so me being the Awesome lunatic that I am. Wow. <laughs> well, you've got me beat. Okay. Your turn. Um, truth. Oh, no, I had the best dare picked out. <laughs> I'm sorry. That's fine, you're just boring. Um, <laughs> okay. What's the farthest you've ever gone? What do you mean? In first base, second base, third base. I suck at baseball. You suck at this game too. <laughs> I'm sorry, okay. Uh, okay, second base, I guess. Ooh. Yeah. With whom? Uh, this guy, John. He was this little guy. He had a cute little birthmark on his cheek. I don't know, he was, he was sweet. That one's hot. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, okay, honest. What did you think of me when you first met? <clears throat> I thought you were beautiful. Four turns? What? Roosevelt has four turns, right? Oh, um, yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah. All right. 
Why don't you like loosen up? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, lean exactly like that. Um, do something with your hands. That's good. Cool. Yeah, I think you got it. Um, you should sleep over. Ta-da! <laughs> awesome. Here. Your parents seem really nice. Yeah. Are you okay? I'm fine. Just a lot on my mind. Okay, so, um... I was thinking of ending things with Troy. Really? Why? Um... Fresh perspective. Thank you so much for having me to lunch, Mr. and Mrs. Foster. No, oh, yeah. thank you. Anne told us how welcoming you've made her feel, and we really appreciate it. See, sweetie, I told you that it would be nice. She didn't really want to go that first night. We practically had to push her out the door. <laughs> <laughs> so, Haley, we saw your dad at the church today. We were missing you. Mm. Why didn't you come? I'm not the biggest fan of that church. I actually don't go there anymore. Really? How come? I guess my godfather used to go there a lot, and um, then he came out and got excommunicated, so... Um, he came out like he was gay? Mm-hmm. Sorry to hear that. Yes, but... I'm sure that they would accept him back once he got in hell, right? Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, they would do that. Yeah. I'm sorry. Um, <clears throat> I have to go. Kelly, 
wait. I'm sorry. That was bullshit. I'm so sorry about my parents. They can be blunt. Blunt? Tell me one thing. Do you agree with them? Do you agree with them? I think she's right. What we did was wrong. You're not them. As much as you'd like to, I know that you don't believe that. You don't. Look me in the eyes and tell me that you don't have feelings for me. I don't need this drama. worst loneliness is to not be comfortable with yourself. You are perfect, permanently and inevitably flawed. And you are beautiful.